our number one uh, uh, our number one is okay let me hope you are ready all of you to go with number one number one is lion our number one is lion that's our number one Mm -hmm. uh, our number two, our number two, our number two, uh, our number two, our number two, our number two, can we go on? Okay, uh, our number two uh, is um, leopard. Leopard. Our number two is 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 leopard huh class are you there our number two is the leopard huh. okay 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 now our number two is leopard our number three our number three, uh, yeah. our number three is, uh, yeah, let me give you a simple one now. Our number three is tiger. 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 Okay. Our number three is tiger. Our number four, our number four, our number four is the word Bush, 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 bush. Our number four is bush. Okay. Our last number, our last number is forest. Okay. Okay, class, let's go on. I need someone to raise up your hand. Uh, after raising up your hand, I need someone to raise up your hand and you tell us number one, uh, what was number one? What was it saying? What was number one? Uh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Once you raise up the hand, then I will pick you. I will send you something. Uh, that will allow you to uh -huh. Jerome and Ryan. Can you unmute yourself? Jerome. Good, Jerome. Can you tell us number one? You read, the, you say the word and spell it. Uh -huh. Lion. Yes. 
Can you spell it? L I O N. Good. Good, 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 Jelom. You're a good boy. Jelom got this one right. The word is lion. Yeah, the word it was lion. Jelom, you are a wonderful boy. Okay, thank you. You can mute yourself. After unmuting, mute yourself so you don't get a hum. Let me hear Dennis Chizito. Are you there? Yes. Uh huh. What was number two, Dennis? Leopard. Leopard. Good. Can you spell the word leopard? L E O P A R A D. Repeat the word, Dennis. L E O L E. So can you say the word again? Uh huh. L E O E O. Mm-hmm. P-R-D. Well, Pat. Good. Good, 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 Dennis. You can mute yourself. Mute yourself quick. So you don't make noise for others. Yeah, uh-huh. you are a wonderful. Austin. Austin, are you there? Austin. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Austin, are you there? Austin. Yes. Right uh, here. They the say yes, teacher. They say yes, teacher. Austin, are you there? Yes, teacher. Uh, read for us number three. Tiger. Tiger. Good. Spell the word tiger. Uh huh. T. T. I I G G E A R R good 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 boy Austin good boy Austin mute yourself please okay uh huh let me go to another one Samanda Rodini are you there Yes, Samanda, go on. Our bush. number four. Rodin, bush. I, bush, uh huh. Spell the word bush, uh huh. B. B. U. U. S. S. H. H. Good. You are a wonderful boy, Rodin. Thank you very much, uh, Rodin. Yes. Okay. I see very people putting up their hands here. Let me put the last person here. I see my friend Joy Tony is there. How are you, Joy Tony? Okay, my friend Joy Tony. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. 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 Hop. 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 Are you there? Hop. Please hop. Hop, are you there? Hop. Hop Mwende, are you there? Hop. Hop Mwendeke. Okay, Mwendeke. Okay, you see, you have put your name and you're calling Hop. Hop Mwendeke. Hop. You see, it told you. She's not Hop Mwende. She's currently praise. It's a mistake. Is called the Kalendi Praise. Okay, let me let me rename her Praise. Okay, so Praise, can you read Praise? The last word. Praise, are you there? She's off. Okay, Obed Freeman. Yes. Yes, they say, teacher. They say yes, teacher. Freeman yes. Obed, are you there? Yes, Tisha. Okay, spell the last word. What was the word, Freeman? Forest. 
Forest. Spell the word forest. Forest. Mm -hmm. F, 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 F O R, R E. Yes. S. A, yes. T. The word is forest. Forest. Good boy. Good boy, good boy, good boy, good boy, Freeman Obed. You can mute yourself now. Good. So, class, those are the words we had, and my friends have been uh, my friends have been sending the answers here. Uh -huh. uh, Hosea said forest good. Um, Amanya said forest good. Joy Tony said oh, okay, uh, okay, uh -huh. okay. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay. Okay. So, Kiras. So, Kiras. Okay. So, Kiras, uh, we are now here uh, with our sparing, but I need one person. I need, uh, I need one person. I need one person here. I need one person here to read for us all the words. I need the one person here to read all the words, to read all the words that we have written here, that we have written here. Mm -hmm. uh, let me give a, a chance to oh, oh, flank. There is flank to Mwebaze. Flank Mwebaze, are you there? Frank. Yes. They say yes, teacher Frank, are you there? Yes, yes, teacher. Aha, uh -huh. we are reading all the words there, the five words. The first one. Lion. The second one. Leopard. Leopard, say leopard. Leopard. Leopard, say leopard. Leopard. It's Leo, not let's see L E O Leo. Uh -huh. Leopard. 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 Okay. Uh -huh. Then another one. The next word. Tiger. 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 Good. Another one. Bush. Another one is bush. Another one is what? Bush. Then the forest. last one. The last one is forest. Forest. Thank you very much, Flung. You deserve a very big hand clap, but I'm just going to give you flowers. Flowers from teacher and very many others. Good. So, Kiras, um, in the last topic when we are here, uh, remember we are in Pitu and we are looking at common animals. And the common animals we looked at last time, they were domestic animals. So, class, who is here to tell me what did we say the answer as domestic animals? What are domestic animals? Uh -huh. I need I need someone. Uh -huh. There is Melissa. 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 Melissa, are you there? Melissa? Yes, teacher. Okay, Melissa, can you define for us what are domestic animals? Domestic animals are animals which stay at home. Good, good, good girl. So all of us in our sitting room, we can say domestic animals are animals which stay at home. Melissa, you can mute yourself. Ashley, are you there? Ashley? Yes, teacher. Yes. Ashley, can you give some, some of the examples of domestic animals we looked at last time? Okay. Okay. I want to. Yes. Dog. Dog. Good. Another one. Birds. Birds. <laughs> Oh, no, no. Uh -huh. Another one, you have a chance. Another animal which stays at home, apart from the dog. Cats. Cats, good. 
Uh -huh. I see my friend here is in the Galaxy Tab A. Uh -huh. Are you there? Say your name. Somebody, say your... somebody Chitata. Oh, Chitata. Chitata. Yes, Chitata. Can you give us another animal which stays at home? There is a goat. There is a goat. Good. Another one. Cow. There is a cow. Good. Chitata. Good. Thank you. Okay. Um, uh -huh. So class, let's go on. Let's go on class here. Let's go on. Uh -huh. I see uh -huh. there is someone called Accord. 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 Are you there? Accord. Accord. Yeah. Uh -huh. Are you there? Oh, he's not there. Let me give a chance to Annie Fancy. Annie Fancy, are you there? Yes. Uh huh. Another animal which stays at home. See. Yes, teacher. Yes. Can you tell me another animal that stays at home? A cow. A cow. Good. 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 <laughs> You can mute yourself. Thank you. Mute yourself. Thank you. Good. So, class, uh, when you go on, uh, we are going to, we also looked at some animals. Uh, apart from being home, I see people here. Uh -huh, they're saying ox, rabbit, pig. Good. That's Ian, Kyla, rabbit, Ian. Jose is saying a horse. Thank you. Thank you, Jose. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Keep those answers coming in. I'm going to read Obed, cat, uh -huh. uh, sheep from Joy Tony, my friend. Uh -huh. Kyla is saying a cat. Itarangi is saying cow and goat. Obed, dog. Uh -huh. Cows and goats from Fidel, a donkey. Uh -huh. Thank you very much for those answers coming in. Now, class, uh, for today, uh, what we call wild animals. Now, today our focus is on wild animals. Uh, I'm going to request everybody uh, uh, to lower your hands so that I can be able to know who is putting up the hands before we go on. Thank you very much. Everybody now, you can put your hands down. Thank you, thank you. Mm-hmm, uh -huh. good. So class, um, I see Nazwa put down the hands and uh, Lydia, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so class, when you look at wild animals, um, we are talking about animals, uh, we are talking about animals, we are talking about animals, uh, we are talking about animals, uh, which stay in the bush. You're talking about animals which stay in the bush. We are talking about animals which stay in the bush. We are talking about animals which stay, which stay in the forests. We are talking about animals which stay in water. Therefore, we say that wild animals are animals which stay in the bush, which stay in the forest, or which stay in water. You can give any, if you do, even if you don't give all of them, you can even say, teacher, wild animals are animals which stay in the bush. And you end there, your answer is correct. Someone can say, wild animals are animals which stay in the forest. You also end there, your answer is correct. Or someone can say, wild animals are animals which stay in water. Your answer is correct. But even you can put all of them, show that uh, uh, for me, I know them. Wild animals are animals which stay in the bush, which stay in forest, and which stay in water. And you go ahead and put your full stop there. Mine is missing, but let me put it there. 
Mm -hmm. Those are the animals which stay in the bush and you put your full stop and you go away and you get your tick, isn't it? Now class, the next question I'm going to ask you is very simple. Uh -huh. I see people already raising up the hands. The question I'm going to ask is very simple. Uh -huh. Someone is asking, teacher, we write. No, don't write. Uh -huh. Don't write now. We shall put the work in our WhatsApp group. Then we shall pick that work and write it in your free time when no one is disturbing you. So class, now, the next question I'm going to ask is going, is going to be simple. Uh -huh. And that question is going to be very simple since all of us already we know the answers. Uh -huh. It goes. Uh, it goes. Uh -huh. Can you write, can you state any two examples of worried animals? Can you give me those animals which stay in the forest? Can you give me those animals which stay in the bush? Can you give me those animals which stay in water? Can you give me those animals uh, which don't stay with us? For them, they are always in the bush. They don't come to disturb us. And I will be writing those answers for you. I will be writing all those answers for you as we go on. Even if I have my answers, but my answers are not correct, yours are the ones which are correct. Even the teacher doesn't know the answers, but I'm very sure you know the answers class. So let's go on. Let's go on. You will be giving me the answers. Then I will be writing. In case I don't pick you, because we are very many, uh, because we are very many, you can keep the answers coming in in our chats. I will write them. Let me first pick one answer from the chat. Hitabanji is saying, teacher, write. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Hitabanji is saying, teacher, don't forget to write uh, the one animal called tiger. You see, I'm beginning by writing the answers in the charts. So even if I don't pick you, I will be able to see your answer. So Itabanji is saying, teacher, write my answer. Korudi. Uh -huh. Itabanji is saying, teacher, don't forget to write my answer. Korudi tiger. Don't forget to write my answer. Korudi tiger. And I've written tiger. And this tiger is, is coming from my friend. Korudi. Hitabaji, Hitabanji, thank you. See, even I'm answering, I'm answering the answers from the chats, so you can even send your chat. Uh -huh. Obed Freeman, uh -huh. Amanya is saying, and Obed Freeman, they are saying, teacher, right there, a snake. You see? Uh -huh. Joy Tone, my best friend, is saying, teacher, right there, cheetah. Uh -huh. Is that the correct spelling for cheetah? Uh -huh. Is that the correct spelling for cheetah? As we are checking for that sparing for cheetah, uh -huh. as we are checking for the sparing for cheetah, 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 cheetah. So, uh -huh. a cheetah is like this one. Ah, you see? Good. So, I'm writing the answers in the chat. Don't feel ashamed. Uh -huh. Don't feel sorry, not ashamed. Don't say the teacher is not picking me. Now, let me pick my people who are putting up the hands. I see. Lay, 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 lay. Lay, are you there? Oh, I'm going to take away the chance of from Lay and I give it to William. William, are you there? William? Yes. Uh huh. They say yes, teacher. William, are you there? Yes, teacher. Uh huh. Give us another animal which is wild, which stays either in bush, water, or anywhere. Yes, go on. Uh -huh. A shark. A shark. Good. A shark stays. Where does a shark stay, William? Water. Stays in water. Good boy. Thank you. Uh -huh. Gertrude. Gertrude, are you there? Gertrude. Lion. Lion. Oh, Gertrude. I'm hearing a big voice. Say lion. Gertrude, lion. Good, Gertrude. Thank you. Where does the lion stay? Gertrude, she's already off. Oh, no. Okay. Mm -hmm. Let me hear. In me... bush. In bush. Nina. Nina, are you there? Uh -huh. 
Yes. Yeah, Nia is Nina give us one one way. Elephant. Elephant. Next time you reduce on the volume of the TV in the back, you are making noise for people, Nina. Thank you. Thank you. Next time when you are picked, you reduce the volume. Yeah. There is the uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. there is Nyanzi. Nyanzi, are you there? Nyanzi, are you there? My friend Nyanzi, I want, don't want to miss Nyanzi. Nyanzi, are you there? Hello, Nyanzi, are you there? Yeah. Nyanzi, you're going to miss my chance. Of but why are they saying Nyanzi? Why are they saying Nyanzi? Did what did he say? Nyanzi, Nyanzi. Mm. Say it's your name, you say were. your name. Jonathan Nyanzi. Yes, you are Nyanzi. So tell us one this wild animal. Uh -huh. uh, a snake. A snake is already there. Mm -hmm. Another one. Nyanzi, bye. Bye, Nyanzi is not ready. Yet the phone is on. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. There is Philip. Philip, are you there? Philip? Whoa. Yes, Philip. Another one is what? Whoa. Whoa. Sorry? Wool. A wool? Can you spell Whoa. it? Yes. Yes, spell it. Spell it. W? Yes. Oh, yes. Me. L. L. F. F. A wolf. Good. Philip, you're a good boy. Where does. Okay, Philip is off. Thank you. I love what I'm seeing here. Mm -hmm. Let me give a chance to Shiba. <coughs> Shiba. Shiba, are you there? Okay. It seems my friends which are here. Um. Namuri Shiba, are you there? Oh, we can't hear from Shiba. Okay, we have lost her. Thank you, Shiba. We have lost you. Are you there, Shiba? She's off. Now, class, let me turn. Let me turn to my chats. You know, I like the answers in the chats are so good. Uh huh. Amanya is saying, teacher, write hyena. You see? Hyena, hyena. Good, 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 good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Joy Eaton is saying, a bear. There is a bear. That is from Melissa Chibuka. There is a bear. Uh huh. There is a bear, and even me, I don't know a bear, but I'm going to write it. I'm going to write the bear. Let me write the bear. Mm -hmm. Let me write the bear. Let me write the bear. Let me write the bear. Let me write the bear here. Let me write the bear. Uh -huh. Call a bear. Uh -huh. There is a bear there. Mm -hmm. Last, can we go on with another one? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm picking from the charts. Someone is saying, "Teacher, don't write, don't forget to write a fox." Uh -huh. He's called Ramula Simon. Uh, okay, he's saying, "Teacher, don't forget to write a fox." There is someone called the fox. You see answers in her. Someone is saying, "Baron." He's saying, "Teacher, don't forget to write buffalo." Buffalo, buffalo is there. Buffalo, buffalo. Uh huh. You see, answers in the chats are so wonderful. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. Baron is saying, Teacher, don't forget to write a rhino. Good, there is a rhino. I'm writing a rhino here. Mm -hmm. I like the answers in the chat. Uh, okay, my friend is saying, Write fish. Let me see who's saying fish. Uh huh. Is called, eh? Is it Rukutia, Rukuteria? He's saying, right fish, teacher. 
Uh -huh. Mtono is saying, teacher, don't forget a fish because it stays in water. You have said the wild animals stay in water. Mm -hmm. Mumbua, Ravenda is saying, Zebla, teacher, don't forget to write Zebla. Zebla is also there. And I cannot fail to write Zebra there because Zebra is also there. So let me write Zebra. Uh -huh. You see, answers are coming in in the charts. Even if I don't pick you, uh -huh. Uh -huh. someone say mad fish. Zebra from William. William, William, thank you. I've written the Zebra. Mm -hmm. Someone said, teacher, don't forget to write the crocodile. Good. There is a crocodile here. I have to write the crocodile, croco, cloco, crocodile. It's called crocodile, crocodile. You see? Uh, I love what I'm seeing. Let me give people who are putting up the hands to give us. Nabaseni, <laughs> Patricia. Patricia, are you there? Hello, Patricia. Oh, it seems Patricia can't unmute herself and give us the answer. Let me give a chance to another people here. Uh-huh, 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 I see. Uh -huh. There is Sahala Amazon, Amazon, eh? Amazon, Sahala, are you there? Oh, he's unable to unmute herself. Jeremiah? Yes, I'm here. Okay, say your name, say your name. I'm Sahara Amazon. Okay, good, Sahara. What's the answer there? That is not there on the list. What's the answer? Panda. Sorry? A panda. Good. There is a panda. A panda, a panther? Panda. Like the one I've written there on your screen? Yes. Good. Good, Sahara yes. Amazon. You can mute yourself. Jelmaya, are you there? Jeremiah. Okay, yes, teacher. Jeremiah, can you give us another answer? Sorry? Oh, Jeremiah, we can't hear from Jeremiah. Let me go to my chats. The answers are there. Keza is saying, teacher, you haven't written the word monkey. Yes, I haven't written the word monkey, yet the monkey is also there. So I won't write the monkey so that my friend doesn't get it right. Okay, mm -hmm. I won't write the monkey here. There is a monkey uh -huh, from Kaiser, you see? So they are very, very many. You can't finish all of them. Uh -huh. Someone is saying, teacher, a monkey and a panda have written all of them. That is unfancy. Uh -huh. Fidel is saying, teacher, don't forget to write a hippo. Yes, I cannot forget to write a hippo, a hippopotamus, a hippo, a hippo. I'm writing a hippo. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. Another one is saying, teacher, leopard. Good. Already we saw leopard in our sparings. And someone is saying, teacher, don't forget to write the leopard, leopard. The leopard is there. The leopard is there. Good, good, good. Uh huh. Someone is saying, teacher, a frog from Kaila. A frog from Kaila. Good. A frog stays in water. A frog stays in water. You see? Uh huh. I love the answers which are coming in from my chats. So the chats are okay. Lion already said by Hitawanji. Someone saying, teacher, put a chimpanzee. Yes. A chimpanzee is also there. You see, our answers are very many. There is a chimpanzee. There is a chi, a chimpanzee. Uh -huh. You see, mm -hmm. good class, good class. There is a giraffe from Ashley. He's saying a giraffe, a giraffe, a giraffe, a giraffe, a giraffe. Uh -huh. It's like this. Uh -huh. Or you can say it's a giraffe or it's a giraffe. Mm -hmm. Keza is saying, teacher, there is another one called the baboon. Don't forget to write it, teacher. There is a baboon. There is a baboon. Okay. Ah, you see? Uh-huh. 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 There is a lizard. Good. From Mumbai, Rahim. He's saying, teacher, write a lizard there. A lizard. A lizard. A lizard. Ah. Uh-huh. They are called lizards, or you can call them geckos. Huh? 
the geckos, the Baganda called them Mukonkome, mm -hmm. with a very big head. So my dear friends, we cannot write out of them, but those ones we have written, those ones, let me get some people who are alive, who are here, raising up the hands. Uh -huh. There is John. John, are you there? John. John, are you there, my friend John? Yes, teacher. Uh-huh. Any other we have left outside? Say it so we can write Gor it here. Sorry? Gorilla. There is gorilla. A gorilla. Good boy. There is a gorilla. There is a gorilla. There is a gorilla. Where is my gorilla? I have my gorilla, but I will show you my gorilla next time. Thank you very much, young boy. There is a gorilla. Thank you. Thank you. There is a gorilla. There is a gorilla. There is a gorilla. Uh -huh. So these ones were mine. Zebula, you have said zebula. So I will cut off the zebula. I will cut off the zebula and write the gorilla. The gorilla, the mountain gorilla. We have mentioned the snake. We need to mention a rat. You see, we have mentioned the sheep. So I'm removing this where your mind had given you, but you have said everything. So I'm removing my answers because the answers for teacher are very few, yet for you had very many. You see. You are better than the teacher. You know very many answers than the teacher. Uh -huh. I'm still giving a chance. I have what right. Mm -hmm. Other examples, keep them coming. Uh -huh. Someone is saying, teacher, write a deer. Yes, there is a deer. There is a small animal called deer. Even me, I know it. Uh, the answer was from Sahara, Sahara Amazon. Uh -huh. Knows it. Uh -huh. Someone is saying, teacher, don't forget to write a tortoise. A tortoise. A tortoise, uh -huh. a turtle and a tortoise. Uh -huh. You see that one from Mumbai, Mumbu, Mumbua. Yes, there is a black panther uh -huh. from Abimanya. He's saying, teacher, write a panther. There is a black panther of Wakanda. We see, we had that one. Uh -huh. uh, someone is saying a turtle. Someone is saying a turtle. A cola bear already mentioned someone is saying a tattoo. Who is saying a tattoo? I need to read someone who said the tattoo. There is hmm. Fidel is saying antelope. Someone is saying antelope. Yes, here saying teacher, don't forget to write the antelope. You see, the answers are very many. Keep those answers coming in. Someone Joy Tony is saying kangaroo. Teacher, don't forget to write a kanga. A kangaroo. Mm -hmm. You see, the answers are very many. But due interest of time, you cannot finish everything, but you can keep those answers coming. But they are very many. Someone is saying, Teacher, write a cobra. A cobra is a snake. Someone is saying, Teacher, write a water hog. I love that. That is a wild pig. Uh -huh. Good. Someone, Annie, is saying, Teacher, don't forget to write a cob. Oh, let me write a cob there. And I end there. So, Thank you very much, class. We can write answers and we don't finish them. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Someone is saying, okay, sharks, rhinos, palo, giraffe. I think we have written everything here. So let's go back to class. Now I'm going to ask everybody to lower your hands. Thank you. Thank you. Tony, lower your hands. Sahala, lower your hands. Keida, all of you. Raise, lower your hands down. Such an, uh -huh. Good, 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 good. I see people. Can we lower our hands? Uh -huh. Gabriela, Sassira, can we raise, uh, can we lower our hands down? Can you put down the hands? Thank you. I need to see everybody putting down the hands. Uh -huh. You can keep the answers coming in the chats. Uh -huh. Someone is saying, teacher, don't forget to write the dolphin. Yeah, dolphin is a type of a fish called dolphin and the penguin. You see? Dolphin, a dolphin, uh -huh. and a penguin. So let's go on. Let's read, put down our hands. Now, class, I'm going to pick someone to name. Which animals are these ones that I put here? I have got my two animals there. Are you looking at them? Mm -hmm. If you are there, what animals are those ones? Who tell me? Tell me, tell me, tell me. Let me give you uh, Antono. Antono, are you there? Frog. This one is a frog. Good. Another one. And the lion. 
and the lion, you were a good girl. Flowers from the teacher. Okay, you can meet yourself and we go. You can meet yourself and we sing. Let me give a chance to Gabriela Musimenta. Are you there? Yes. Yes. Uh -huh. I want you to name these animals on your screen. Are you seeing them? Yes. Uh huh. One is what? Snake. This one in green. Uh huh. Then this one in blue. Fish. Fish. Good girl. Flowers from teacher. You can meet yourself and we go. Uh huh. Good. Mm, do I have another animal coming in? Yes, I have more animals coming in, and the chance goes to the chance goes to Semanda Rodini. Semanda Rodini, yes, are you there? Yes. yes Which teacher. animal is here? Which animal is here? This first one here, and I'm going to write the answer there. Are you seeing it on your screen? Yes. Sorry, 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 sorry. Are you seeing that I'm on your screen? Yes, teacher. It's what? Say its name, and I give you a, a, a clap. It is a rhino, teacher. It's a rhino. You are a wonderful boy, Rodini. Teacher is going to clap for you. One, two, three. <clears throat> Good. It's a rhino. Do you know how to spell the word rhino, Rodini? Oh, teacher. Can you spell the word ro 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 rhino? Ara. Oh, H H I I N N O. The word is what? Rhino. Rhino. Good. This one is a rhino. So, uh huh, uh huh. Thank you. Let me give a chance to another one. You can mute yourself. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Rodney. Let me give a chance to 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 to. Okay, there is Jeremiah. Jeremiah, are you there? Jeremiah? Yes. Okay, which animal is that one next? Baboon. Is it a baboon? Gorilla. It's a gorilla. It's a gorilla. It's a mountain gorilla. Thank you very much, Jeremiah. You can mute yourself and we go on. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, class. So the animals are very many and I cannot, and I cannot. So some people even have put the answers in the chat. Teacher, me, me, me. Teacher, I'm seeing there. What am I, I'm seeing? The other one was a snake. Thank you, me, 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 teacher. Uh, okay, someone is saying, teacher, don't forget to write the hair. Yes, the hair is so wonderful. Even me, I like the hair. <clears throat> so class, those are the some of the animals that maybe we don't know. Uh, if you don't know how a certain how a certain uh, animal looks like, you will tell me. I, I will give you that. I will show you that. Uh, you can write it in the chat, teacher. For me, I don't know. I want to see how this animal looks like. I will show you that animal at the end of our lesson there, because I have very many now. Mm -hmm, you see, uh -huh. I need someone here. I'm going to send someone here. Mm -hmm. I'm going to pick someone here to read for me these words. When I point, you say, teacher, that one is this. That one is this. That one is that. That one is that. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Someone says he doesn't know how a hippo looks like. Uh -huh. A hippo is here. A hippo is here. Are you saying a hippo? A hippo is here in my sack. Uh -huh. Are you saying that one is a hippo? Mm -hmm. Someone is saying, me teacher was Evans, doesn't know how a hippo looks like. I think I've seen how a hippo looks like. Uh -huh. Josephine, are you there? Josephine, are yes. you there? Yes. Uh -huh. are, you seeing on your, are you seeing animals on your screen? Yes. Okay. When I underline, you say, which animal is this one I've underlined now? Kangaroo. Good. Which animal is this one I've underlined here? Giraffe. Good. Which animal have I underlined here? I've put in a circle. Which animal I've put in a circle? Antelope. Antelope. Good, Josephine. Which animal is this one I've put in a circle also? 
Panda. Said Panda. Wonderful. Bye. Bye, Josephine. Thank you for that. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So class, due to time, I cannot pick everybody, but you will allow me to take you to our next team. So those are the some of the wild animals. Also, we have taken too much time there. Let's look here. Now, class, we are going to look at the uses of wild animals. What do we get from animals which are, are, are outside there in the bush? Are they useful to us? Yes, they're useful. Uh, if we have lions, if we have zebras, if we have kangaroos, if we have very many animals in the bush, mm -hmm, how are they useful? Yeah, they are useful. So how? One, the teacher says, they give us skin, e.g. the snake and the leopard. Uh -huh. You can look at my picture. People are wearing the skin from the leopard. So uh, the wild animals are good for us. Oh, let me check here. Mm -hmm. Let me first change here. There is something not right here, but you allow me change it here. Okay. So, oh, sorry, 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 sorry. Okay, so let me change here. There is something here. Okay, so uh, you are seeing some people huh, putting on the skin from the leopard. So therefore we say the wild animals, they give us skin too. You can have a look at someone here, drums made of skin. We get the skin from this younger man called the python. Do you know a python? This is a python here. This one is a python. This one is a python here hmm? from the python. You see, this is a python, this one here. So from this python, from this python, we get its skin and from its skin, we make drums. Huh? The Waganda call them Engalabi, you know Engalabi. Uh -huh. So the Engalabi are made from, from, from the, the skins of the snakes. So therefore, uh, uh, where the animals are so good. Mm -hmm. Then it too, they give us horns. Mm -hmm. They give us horns. Uh -huh. Let me show you the one which gives us horns. The one which gives us horns, it is here. The one which gives us horns, it is here. Mm -hmm. The Mr. Rhino. You can look at the horn of the rhino. Are you looking at it here? Its horn is so wonderful. So uh, the rhino gives us the horn and that horn, we use it to make buttons, to make other things. So they get horns. Then there are sources of herbal medicine, herbal medicine, herbal medicine. It's a drug. Eh? Once you get, what you get, you get sick uh, of measles, your mother says, Umana, you give, you give myelana mukene. Hmm? You give mukene, eh? silver fish in bracket mukene. It is a source of herbal medicine, you see? They give us ivory. They give us ivory, mainly the elephant. Then you too, they give us food, you see? They give us food, we eat them. We go in the bush, we kill the buffalo. We come back home, we eat the buffalo. Hmm? I eat together. So those are the, some of the uses of this one. Then two, wild animals bring tourists. Who are the tourists? Those are the people. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. I need someone here to tell me. Uh -huh. They give us bugs. Good. From the skins, we make bugs. Good, 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 good. I see people here. They are giving me answers already. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Who are the tourists? Gemma is saying, teacher, can we write? No, we shall put the answers in our WhatsApp group and our Google Classrooms, we get the, 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 the work and write. Mm -hmm. So class, if I may ask, who are the tourists? Have we ever heard of a tourist? Ashiri, are you there? Ashiri, are you there? Yes. Do you know tourists? Yes. Have we ever seen them? Yes. Who are they? Tell us. Uh -huh. Who are tourists, you think? Tourists are mm. people mm -hmm. 
who come to the zoo to look at animals. Good. Can we clap for Ashley? You are a wonderful boy. Those people come from outside. They come from outside the countries. They come. Even as we can be tourists, you can move from Kampala, you go to Jinja to look at those animals, you see? Now in my picture, you can see those people. There is a young girl here and an old lady here. Are you seeing them? They are looking at the zebras. Eh? So when they come to our country, they bring money. They give us money. Eh? They pay to see our animals. So we are getting money from these wild animals. That's why we need them. And as she has told us, these are the people who go to the zoo to see those animals. Good, good, Ashley, you are. Mm -hmm. Okay, okay, thank you, thank you. So I like it. Mm -hmm. So class, I think we can go on. Mm -hmm. So apart from being useful, these animals are so deadly to us. They are dangerous. They are so, so, so dangerous. Mm -hmm. How are they dangerous? I need someone to read my answers. After reading my answers, then I will explain. Uh -huh. I see many people raising up their hands. Someone is saying, thank you, teacher. OK, thank you, thank you also. Uh -huh. Let me go here. People who are raising up the hand. Jelly and Naziwa, are you there? Jerry yes, and Nazwa, are you there? Yes, yes. teacher. Uh -huh. Can you read for us what I wrote here, how these animals are dangerous? Let's go. I'm going to underline that word. Uh -huh. Can you read that word? Uh -huh. The sentence. They eat our crops. Good. So some animals, when they go, like uh, you can meet yourself, Jelly and Nazwa. Thank you. So when these animals come, uh, they just do what? When they come, uh, they go to our garden and they eat our crops. Hmm? So they are so bad. Let me say, uh -huh, my friend here is going to say, teacher, you hate me. Uh -huh. Kaila, Kaila, are you there? Yes, teacher. Okay, you are reading our next statement. Our next sentence, I'm underlining it here. Uh huh. Yes. They eat, they eat, kill people. Uh huh. When they put this one, we can say they eat or they can kill people. Kayla, are you there? Yes. Can you tell us one animal which can eat people? Lion. Lion, you are a wonderful boy. That's why I'm giving you flowers. My friend, Joy Tony. Joy Tony, thank you for the work. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm giving the chance to Isaiah. Are you there? Are you there? Yes. Yes. Read, yes. For us. Read for us this statement here. The last one here. Uh -huh. They spread this. They spread diseases to people. Uh huh. Good. Uh huh. Uh huh. Let me see if I can give you answers now. People are uh, all my people get diseases from these wild animals. To give an example, uh, uh, the last time in a district called the Kasese, there was Ebola disease. Mm -hmm. Even we can write it there. Let me let me write it here on our answer to make it a good answer. We are going to make it a good answer. We're going to make it a good answer here. Mm -hmm. We're going to say, they spread to these people like, uh -huh, like Ebola, like Ebola, like Ebola. Uh -huh. You see, uh, in Kasese, there was a disease called Ebola, and they said Ebola was coming from monkeys, chimpanzees, and those gorillas. So uh, don't play with wild animals. Some wild animals have got diseases. So therefore, it's not good to be near them. So class, mm -hmm. I want to, we still have our one or two minutes before we end. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. uh, uh, uh -huh. Apart from the answers I have given you, can you tell me any other bad thing about animals? 
which are live in the bush. Mm -hmm. uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay. Uh -huh. Tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, tell me, class. Uh -huh. Namugele Patricia, are you there? There are two. Namugele Patricia, are you there? Oh, she's not there. Thank you. So, class, can you tell me, can you raise up your hand and tell me, teacher, for my thing, um, apart from eating our crops, apart from killing, they eat or kill people. Mm -hmm. You can go ahead and say they, and you can say they do what? They spread diseases to people like Ebola, disease like Ebola. Mm -hmm. So tell me, because you may go there and say, for me, I've been studying, uh, for me, I've been studying uh, 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 on online. And the teacher told us, where did these animals spread diseases to people? And ask you, Sha, you are lying. Tell us one disease which is spread by wild animals. You tell him, Ebola. It is brought by monkeys. And gorillas, you see, you'll be a wonderful boy. Uh -huh. Any other, any other who is saying it, teacher, uh -huh. diseases like bad flu, good, 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 good. There is disease like swine flu brought by these pigs from the villages, from, sorry, from the bush. Mm -hmm. I see them raising up the hand. Uh, let me give a chance to who? Uh -huh. Matthew, Matthew there. Matthew, are you okay? Yes. Matthew. Uh -huh. Are you giving us any other one way how animals are dangerous? They, they destroy people's houses. Good, Matthew. You see, I didn't know that that answer was there, but Matthew told me, yeah, write even this answer here. They destroy people's houses. Yes, they can come and find your house when it is there and they destroy it. E.g. the elephant. So you say, uh, some wild animals uh -huh, destroy our houses. They can destroy our houses. Good. Mm -hmm. They can destroy our houses. You see, I didn't know that answer, but someone said, teacher, for oh, my know that answer, please. So pick me. And I picked that person. That's why we have it there. So let's go on. Let's go on. Mm -hmm. Any other any other person, please, as we end our lesson, because we are towards the end and we don't want to take more time. We don't want to take more time. Okay. Let me pick another one here. If you are raising up the hand, uh -huh. someone is saying what? Okay. Mm -hmm. I want to see those ones who are putting up the hand. Evans, Evans, are you there? Okay, there is my friend here, Akrodibo Fauza. They have said, teacher, they eat our domestic animals. Good boy. They eat this. Uh -huh. They come and eat our, our, our animals, our domestic animals, and even birds. They come and eat our hens at home. They eat our okay. <laughs> You see, I didn't know these answers, but my friends are giving me the answers. You see, even the teachers don't know everything. Even you, you know better than the teachers. So thank you. Thank you. See, I've added more answers from you. You are wonderful. You are wonderful class. Uh -huh. Let's go on. I'm still waiting. They destroy our crops already. They bite and cause infections. Good. We have written that one. Mm -hmm. Uh -huh. They eat our food. Mm -hmm. That's our crops. Thank you, Salah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. um, may I have the last one here and we end if he's there. Okay. Amanya, are you there? Amanya? Yes. Uh -huh. Are you giving us the answer, Amanya? Yes. Uh huh. Say it. They eat our domestic birds. They eat our domestic birds. Let me write it here. It is also another different statement. Uh huh. Can you give us one bird they eat? They eat our domestic. They eat our, 
They eat hens. Hens. Can you tell me which animal? One animal which come at home and eat our domestic birds. Uh huh. Hello. Oh, you don't know. Lion. We have lion. lion. Good. The lion will come and eat the fox, the wolf. Thank you very much. You can meet yourself. So, class. Uh, finally. We have come to the end of our lesson today. Uh, I know the answers are very many, but we can't finish all of them. Uh, we can write them up tomorrow. So therefore, we shall end from our lesson from here. Uh, but before ending our lesson, uh, 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 I'm going to, uh, uh, to tell you that all this that we have read, uh, we won't put them in our WhatsApp group so that you can go and copy even in our Google Classrooms. Uh -huh. When you go there, check for the material, you check for those lesson notes and you write them there. Then uh, I'm going to put the activity, it is here, even I'm going to put it on our Google Classroom. It is saying, define the term wild animals. Uh -huh. Another one is there, from which animal do we get the following? Where will you get skin, ivory, meat, horns? Uh -huh. Then here, which name of the animals which are there? One is there, another one is there. Then another one is saying, okay, how are they useful? So that's the activity that we have. Uh, we are going to put it in our WhatsApp group and uh, we shall write the notes from the beginning up to the end. So class, um, let me ask someone here. Mm -hmm. uh, let me ask someone here to give us a prayer. Mm -hmm. If you are willing to give us a prayer, raise up your hand. Uh -huh. Because there is no one who is raising up the hand. Oh, all of you want to give us a prayer? Okay, let me give the, my chance to Tony. Tony, Tony, how are you, my friend, Tony? Joy, Tony, are you there? Yes, teacher. Yes. Today I didn't pick you, but don't get annoyed. Can you give us a prayer and we end our lesson, Tony? Our Father, who art in heaven, Allah be thy name, thy kingdom come. I will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we, for, as we forgive those who, the, those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Thank you, my friend Tony, for that. In the prayer. name of the Father and all the Son and all the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Thank you very much, Tony. So let me give uh, back uh, uh, the, the the mic to 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 my to my admin, uh, Mr. Dennis. Are you there? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, you're back. Welcome back, Dennis. Thank you. Okay, okay thank you. You can take uh, over and, uh, we end Michael, the is Michael there? Uh, yes, he, Mr. Dennis, I've managed oh, to finish oh, up the lesson. He's still on. Uh, okay, can you walk them through Google Classroom how to submit the assignment? Okay, so I'm going to to give them a simple video. I'm going to share a simple video with them on how they can be able to upload their assignment. So let me first launch it here as they are on. Let them keep on. Let me start it here. I'm going to use the mobile version of <clears throat> uploading. I'm just starting up the video here. Though it is taking some time to start up. Okay. So it has launched. Okay, so I'm sharing the video now.
Hello, our learners. Uh, you upload our work? Mr. Michael, can you increase on your volume? Okay, let me try. So I'll go to classroom and I'll click there. So under classroom, I'll go direct to my class, which looks like it is. I'm not using the other classes we're using, I'm just simply using this type of class and grade as a student. So I'll look for the assignment. It could be even written with assignment, activity, some sort of. And then I'll click under assignment. So I can see new assignment. Then I can click there. Then I'll get here a button telling me to add work. I'll click on it to add work. Then I'll get another display down there, which looks like that. There are very many options there. So the easiest option will be now upload. So I'll show me you just took a picture of your work, which you want to submit. You just wrote it and then you took a picture. Maybe you stored it in the phone, some sort of, but you know the work is you want to submit is already in your phone. Go and do the upload to take you direct your phone where you can see and then among all of those maybe pictures and what you may be able to find the work you want to want to submit assuming i want to submit any work maybe that one then from there i'll click up there where i have open then it will upload that work and uh, my class my names so that it will be able to know that I'm the one who submitted it. Now here down you're going to see the word turn in. So you click in, turn in, then they'll bring you to that, to that smaller window to confirm whether you are turning in or you cancel. Canceling means you maybe you had submitted any work you can cancel if that the work you want to submit, I'll just do not say turn in. So turn in. You can see it's trying to initiate your work such that it can be uploaded. So we are saying work submitted. It means that work has been, has been submitted. So you can continue and say, so that means the work has been submitted, so I can even do a back here. So already my work has been submitted, so you can see the work is there, okay? So you can unsubmit in case that is not the work you wanted to do what? To, to submit, or you can even add a comment there, you can say private comments and then you can say add comment. Now that comment will go direct to the teacher. So I can click add comment and then I say teacher is me. It's me, maybe John. It is maybe your name or you want to say something. It's me, John. Cool. Submitted. Submitted. My work. So my work. And then you click in that arrow just next, showing you that please send that comment. So they are sending the comment directly to the teacher. And then you can see that one on Michael because now is a sublan. Teacher is Mitchell have submitted my work. So from there, that's what you have to do. And doing that, it means the teacher has already received that work. And then you can click the backspace and then you go back to your phone display. It means your work has been submitted. Thank you. So you try that and then you start submitting in your work. Okay. I think you have been able to see 
Mr. Mr. Michael. Yes. Can you share with them the meeting ID for today and the password? Because most of them are not in the WhatsApp groups. Eh? Okay. And talk about the meeting also. Because we have like eight who are still there. Okay, let me assume all of us. Okay, I think all of our parents are on right now. Are they on? Yeah, you can share. We have some 70 people still there. Okay. Had you shared that at the beginning? Yeah, but the number was down, was in 50s. Could you please send me send the link because I had not yet connected in my phone via. Oh, sorry. Let so me you share. Let me share. try to do that, or I can check it here. Okay, let me do this, I think. Okay. I think it's okay. So our parents okay. who are still on. It's fine. Uh, our parents who are still on, we have a, a, a general staff meeting. Sorry, a general parents meeting today at noon time. And I will request you to be there. We request you to be there. Uh, some people, we are sending this work in WhatsApp group but some of you, I know you are not in WhatsApp. So you can copy that meeting ID, the one I've put in blue, if you can see it, and you will join using it. The password is also there down. It's called Edify 2021. It's there, uh, you can see, you can see it. it's there. Uh, the meeting ID is 985. Three nine eight eight nine five six one, and the passcode is Edify, capital E Edify twenty twenty one. So you will join the meeting using that meeting ID and the passcode. For those ones who are in WhatsApp group, you can just tap in that link; it will take you directly to the meeting. But those ones who are not in WhatsApp groups, uh, you can easily you can easily enter using the meeting ID. The meeting is going to start at noon. The meeting is going to start at noon, so please be there. The main purpose of the meeting, we are learning more on Google Classroom and next week's timetable. We have changed the timetable, so we need to be there. So some people are saying, uh, you add me to, uh, you just, uh, people are saying, teacher admit the WhatsApp group. So please attend that meeting, then we shall be able to handle those issues. Thank you all. Uh, I wish you the best of today and of any other that you are doing. Let's end our meeting, our, our, our class from here. Bye-bye, everybody. Thank you.